Finally guys, I am back to Bangkok. Wahin trip was wonderful. It was a wonderful escape from Bangkok to the beach, even in the high season. So when is the high season and low season if you are planning your trip to Thailand? When to come to Thailand, the best season and when to avoid? If I want to answer simply, it's always a good time to visit Thailand. But if I want to tell you the real story, you have to watch this vlog because it's totally different when you are visiting Thailand depending on what part of Thailand you are visiting. It's different from the north and the south, the high and low season. Now there are three factors that you should consider before planning your visit to Thailand. The first one is the weather, the second one is the budget and the third one is the situation at the time that you are visiting Thailand. So I'm gonna start with the weather. Now, as I said, guys, the high and low season differs depending on what part of Thailand you are visiting at that time. But in general, starting from November till February, it's the high season, it's cool, and that's the best time to visit Thailand. Now, from March till April, May, it's the hot season. It's really hot, and as you know, in April, Thai people celebrate the Songkran. Now, starting from June till the beginning of October, it's the rainy season. So this is it in general. But if we want to talk about the details according to the map, then you have to watch this part. As you can see guys, according to the map, it's totally different the weather and the season. Because you have the west coast, east coast, south coast and Andaman Sea. And of course the north and Bangkok. Now if we start from the west coast, as you can see, starting from December, January, February, March, April is the best time to visit. West Coast means also the Bangkok, Hua Hin, Cha'am, this area. After that, May is okay, likely to rain. June, July, August, September, October is the rainy season. So, if you don't like rain, then this is the rainy season. After that, November is okay. And of course, starting from December, you will be back to the high season. This is concerning the West Coast. Now, if we go to the East Coast, which is around Pattaya, then starting from December, January, February, March also is the best time to visit. April is likely to rain. And starting from May, June, July, August, September, October is least recommended. So this is also concerning the East Coast. Now if we go to the South, which is the South Coast, around Gulf of Thailand, you have Koh Samui, one of the famous places to visit Suratani, then the best time is starting from April till October. You can see it's totally different. Here, starting from April, May, June, July, August, September, October is the best time. So if you are visiting in the low season, then Koh Samui should be one of your choices. That's it. Now, if we move to the south, around Andaman Sea, where you have Phuket, one of the famous places to visit in the south, January, February, March, and of course December is the high season. The weather is perfect. So if you are going to visit Phuket, starting from December till March is the best time. After that guys, April, it's kindly to rain. From May till October is the rainy season. Lots of people visit Phuket from June, July, August because it's the vacation time in Europe, but it's the rainy season. Moreover, the beach, the waves will be very rough if you are going to visit the surrounding islands with boat trips. So this is it. As you can see, it's totally different from the west to the east, south and Andaman Sea. This map is very important concerning the weather. Now let's talk about the budget. Alright, now the second thing we are going to talk about is the budget. This is also very important like the weather because it depends on the season, how much money you are going to spend once you are visiting Thailand. Let us start from the plane tickets. The plane tickets, I'm talking about the domestic flights. The prices will be totally different between the high and low season. For example, let's say you want to go to Phuket. In the low season, you can take a ticket for 1,200 Thai baht. Two ways from Bangkok to Phuket, from Phuket to Bangkok, only for 1,200 Thai baht, sometimes even less than that. And in the high season, the tickets, the prices will go up till six to 9,000 Thai baht two ways. 
that's it big difference like we were going to Phuket in December to celebrate the new year and we cancelled it because the price was 10,000 Thai baht now if we book after one month now that we are in February the price will go down till 3,000 Thai baht so that's it if you are coming to Thailand and if you want to explore more then in the high season you are going to spend a lot but if you are visiting Thailand in the low season all right rainy season the prices of the domestic flights will be so low that's concerning the domestic flights in Thailand now the second thing I want to talk about are the hotels the hotel prices are also like the ticket prices they are totally different between the high and low season for example in Pattaya you can book a hotel room for 900 Thai baht 1500 Thai baht maybe 2000 Thai baht in the low season in a five star hotel but in the high season it will be more than six to seven thousand Thai baht now that's not the only thing the worst thing is at the peak season new year Christmas the prices will go insane for example we have booked a hotel for 1500 Thai baht per night before Christmas and at New Year's Eve it was 27,000 Thai baht yes guys from $30 to $700 that's the difference between the high and low season and the peak season is the crazy season concerning the budget and prices the hotels and the tickets now another thing are the prices of the tours for example if you are going to take a boat tour around Phuket then mostly the prices are between 1000 till 2000 Thai baht in the high season you are going to pay 3000 4000 Thai baht if you are going to take the same boat tours so that's it guys you are spending a lot in the high season the hotels the tickets the tours you are enjoying the weather of course but at the same time you are paying a lot that's concerning the budget now let's talk about the situation which is also important like the weather and the budget I'm gonna give you two examples Hua Hin and Phuket check the difference between the high and low season and I'm gonna talk about what I mean by the situation at the time that you are visiting Thailand so the high season is a total mess as you saw it's very crowded very busy it's not fun as the low season of course the weather is better but it's very crowded not only the islands also if you are visiting the historical sites so that's it guys if you are visiting Thailand in the high season then you are going to be in a very crowded places the shores the beach there is no privacy and moreover some people love it and some people don't so that's the story between the high and low season concerning the situation in Thailand all right now that you know about the weather the budget and the situation at the time that you are visiting Thailand let's make a conclusion as I said at the beginning of the vlog when is the best time to visit Thailand it's always a good time to visit Thailand that's me I love Thailand it doesn't matter high season low season it's always a good time if you have the chance then take the plane take the ticket and come enjoy your vacation in Thailand but if you are going to talk little bit reasonable then there are some months that you should avoid visiting Thailand now let's go to the map to make the conclusion if you are visiting the west coast then definitely avoid between September till October it will be the rainiest season now if we go to the south to Phuket for example avoid August September and October because if you are going to take as I said boat trips it won't be fun now if you are coming to Thailand in the low season concerning west coast and the south then visit the south coast for example Koh Samui will be the best time to visit between September and October the weather will be perfect so this is it guys depending on what part of Thailand you are visiting you can choose the time and the best trip
So this is it guys, I hope everyone watches this vlog before planning their trip to Thailand. Depending on what part of Thailand you are visiting, then you are going to plan the best vacation to enjoy in Thailand and avoiding surprises. Thank you for watching, stay tuned and subscribe for more from Live Love Thailand.